Do you want to get closer to your partner? Try these 36 questions. But first, I'm going to give you some background on the questions themselves. Uh, we are constantly looking for ways to improve our closest relationships because intimacy is so important to our mental, if not physical, health. Most people seek to maximize their chances of finding and keeping the bonds of love alive. Tests of love like this one can help you determine how strong those bonds are with your particular partner. However, what if you don't have a long-term partner? Is there a reliable way to produce one? These questions were formulated more than 20 years ago to help you arrive at that decision. By asking a potential of interest these 36 questions, you can not only determine whether this is a good mate for you, but you could actually use them to jumpstart your relationship with that person. The researchers who created this hoped that their work, completed nearly 20 years ago, could help advance the science of close relationships. Even the, the questions and the title itself includes the word preliminary. It is even more important then that we keep in mind that the cautions and limitations of the actual test. If they observed it is time for researchers of close relationships to find ways to come back our wayward friend, the true experiment. You know, what they're saying is that life is an experiment and you have to go through these processes to find the answers to the questions that you're looking for, the answers. With this background in mind, here are the 36 questions intended to promote intimacy grouped into the original three sets of 12 items each. The three sets increase in levels of self-disclosure. They require and within each set, the level of self-disclosure increases from question to question. Remember that you don't need to answer each question with your partner or prospective partner. By covering each of the three categories though, you give yourself a better chance of gaining knowledge they may help promote your intimacy with that person. Now, the ideal way to do this is to sit across from each other, face to face, looking into each other's eyes, and being as honest and sincere as possible. Because this is the way that you could read the body language, you could interpret through what you're seeing, because the eyes are the windows to the soul, and you get a closer and more intimate experience. You know, as you see in this picture, you come to love not by finding the perfect person, but by learning to see an imperfect person perfectly. And some of these questions will help you discover if this person is really on the same wavelength as you or not. And if they are, how better to see it than to go through this process. Very simple. It should take you 15 minutes for each section, or you could take as long as you want. Please subscribe, please share, please put this on uh, your uh, Facebook page. Please uh, go to our website and you can download all the questions if you want them. But take your time, enjoy it, and remember, this is a fun experience. If you're doing online dating, this is a great way to break the ice. This is a great way to get the conversation going. And you learn very quickly. Uh, a, a lot about that person. So enjoy it and please come back for more because we make every effort to bring you all the information we can on how to have the best life experiences. See you on the next video. Bye-bye.